coming to you from New York City in the American Star Academy Studios. Hi, I'm Tracy and this is your warm-up video. Now warming up is crucial before any physical activity. A lot of times a tendency to just jump right into things, do not do that. I know you're young, and but I want you to continue to be able to dance and do your thing. I want you to be able to drop it like it's hot, not lukewarm. All right, so some of you are beginners and that's okay. We've catered some of the movements for you so that you can slowly graduate and then you can make the changes as it comes about. For you advanced students, we're ready for you. And you should do this as well. Don't think, oh, I, I know this, I know how to warm up, because a lot of times you don't. And we want you to prevent injuries. So you need to warm up, okay? Let's go. Okay, so before we get started though, I want you to grab some water, because I wanna make sure that you hydrate yourself, okay? So we'll wait. Okay, you ready? <laughs> All right, so we're gonna start off with our legs apart, and we're gonna start off with some neck warm ups. We're gonna to start to the right, and then we're gonna bring it center to the left and back to center, okay? Here we go. First of all, I want you to breathe in, and as you exhale, lean your head to the left. I want you to keep the shoulders down and don't let them sl slant to the side. Shoulders down, keep your arms down. Well, your arms down will remind you to keep your shoulders down. Okay, so now we're gonna go forward to center. Make sure you're breathing in and out through the mouth. In through the nose and out through the mouth. Now we're gonna slowly go to the left. And I want you to keep your focus forward. I'm gonna walk around and see what's going on. Check on the girls over here. All right, she got her hair down, okay? <laughs> All right, so I want you to make, I want you to also engage still. Even though we're not doing core right now, I still want you to pull in. All right, and then you can see how she is, whoop, she's letting you have it right there. Keep the body straight, okay. All right, what's going on? Okay, you're not really leaning. <laughs> All right, let's do it, let's do it. Do you feel that? Mm -hmm. Okay, now I don't want you to overdo it. Now let's go center. So from there, go back to the side. And from the side, watch me, I'm sorry, baby. I want you to go to center, okay? All right, and do you feel in the back of the neck? Mm -hmm. Get the stomach on. You're going center. What, where are you, girl? You are fired, okay? <laughs> Go for it. Okay. And I want you to continue to breathe in and breathe out. Remember to keep the shoulders down. Now we're gonna go to the right again. Breathing in and out. Slowly go back to center. Breathing in and out. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Once again to the left. And remember to breathe. I know it sounds silly, but so often we forget. Okay, all right, so now we're gonna slowly come back to center and this is the last one. Breathe in and out and once again and out. Slowly bring your head up. And now we're gonna do shoulder warm-ups. Okay, so you're gonna put a slight bend in your knee and you're just gonna take your shoulders back. Back. So we're gonna do that back several times and then go forward, okay? Ready, you guys? Yeah. Okay, here we go. All right, see, it's not so hard, okay? <laughs> Trust me, we're gonna go into it slowly, you guys, in computer land. It's gonna be fine, okay? <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna reverse it and we're gonna go forward. And we truly wanna warm up the entire body because when you're dancing, and especially when you start my routine, you're gonna be working on every part of your body, okay? And also, remember to breathe. I know you're gonna get tired of me saying that. Let's reverse it, go back, going backwards. And 
towards the front. Okay, and now we're going to stand up. All right, so now we're going to pull it in and we're going to do ankle. We're going to warm the ankles, all right? Like I said, we're going to do it all. Okay, so we're just going to point forward and we're going to lift and we're going to just rotate it going out as well as going in, okay? Ready, you guys? And also, if you're at home, if you need to use your arms, need to use a chair, do what you got to do. Let's go. Starting to your right. Okay. Keeping your stomach engaged will help this. Keep your balance. And go the other way. Okay, now let's switch. Point it out. Going outside. And the other way. Okay, so now we're going to do ceiling to hip reaches. Okay, so now it's a little ghetto. We're going to get a little a water, a bottle of water. Just because some of you may not have weights at home. So this, you can drink some of it, but you can also use it. And you can always refill it. And this is going to be a weight. So we just need one. I don't know what size this is, but you know, you can see. All right. So I'm going to show you that we're just going to start with the arms down. So both hands are holding the one water. And we're going to reach up to the side and to the hip. And we're going to do the same thing to the other side and to the hip. And so the two of you that do not have it, just clasp the hands. You guys are professional. I love it. <laughs> oh, I love it. OK? And then after that, we're going to do a few up and down. Oops. OK? And so when you do that, let's, let's, let's just bring the arms forward for that, OK? All right, here we go. All right. All right, here we go. To the left and down. To the right and down. To the left. Make sure that you keep your hips center. To the left, to the right, ooh, and down. <laughs> well, my right is actually your left, so that was OK. OK? Again, keep the stomach pulled in, stomach muscles engaged. To the left and down, to the left and down. This is working the entire core area. Up and down, up and down. And now from center, we're going to bring it down and we're going to pull it forward. Pull it up and down, up and down. We're working the arms, we're going to try that. Here we go. Uh. Going to be an animal. Up and down, up and down. You guys okay? Yeah. Up. I have to check on you guys. Let's do. It. You know, let's go up to the the arm reaches again to the left. Okay. Okay. So don't twist. To the left and down. To the right and down. To the left and down. Up and down. Really exert the arm. Okay. Up and down, bring it higher. Up, yes, and down. Up and down, up and down. And you know what, add a little bit more twist and down. Work the obliques. Up and down, up and down, up and down. Now the others. Let me get my water. What's going on? Okay. <laughs> up and down. Up and down. Breathing in and out. 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 Switch. In and out, <laughs> in and out, in and out. How was that? How was that? 
Is that good? Did you feel that? Okay. Did you guys feel? I hope that you did. I hope that you did. Okay, so now we're going to warm it up. We're going to do a little marching, if that's okay with you, all right? And I know it sounds silly, but we're just trying to get the whole body warmed up, okay? So we're just going to march, and we're going to switch the arms as we're mar marching. No arms, swinging arms, running arms, okay? And then we're going to go into a little bit of a run. You guys ready? Here we go. No arms. And you're not trying to get your knees really high. You're just trying to march, a natural march. Shoulders down. Continue to breathe. And you know what? Feel free if you need to stop for any reason. Get a drink of water, whatever you have to do. Don't stop just because Laquita called and you want to be on the phone. Continue your workout. <laughs> Only stop if you have to use the bathroom or get some water, OK? All right, now we're going to swing the arms. The arms are parallel to each other, and they're straight. And don't let it lift your shoulders. We don't want Michael Jackson Thriller going on here, OK? <laughs> So keep the shoulders down. And now we're going to do running arms. We're going to keep the elbows in, and they're going back, straight back. Don't let them get out like this. And so I'm going to march around. I'm going to check on the girls. <laughs> OK, so more. I want more closer to the arm, closer to the body, and tighten the fist. I want more resistance. Think of going forward and back, OK? A little further, get the arm further. Yeah. OK, now we're going to keep the arms, and we're going to start running. Now for this, you really have to breathe. It's not a game. Breathe. Now we want to get the knees up. Now the knees down. And the shoelaces on time. <laughs> what is going on? It's sabotaging me. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Woo! Now we're gonna do some jumping jacks, okay? We're warming up, you guys. Remember, we're getting the body ready. We don't want you to injure yourself. We want you to get your body ready. And this is how you do it, okay? No pain, no gain. <laughs> All right, you ready? Okay, here we go. And we're just going to do the typical jumping jacks. You can do straight arm, bent arm. All right, here we go. Five, six, and seven, and eight. I know it seems monotonous, but it's got to be done. You've got to do it, my friends. <laughs> <laughs> Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Let me check on the girls. Breathe in and out. Breathe in. Good, you guys. And out. Did you see my mic? Breathe in <laughs> and out. In. Now, I told Seth not to turn on the air conditioner, but wow! <laughs> Let's do eight more. Yes, that was very good, you guys. I am so proud of you. All right, so now we're gonna do traveling squat. Okay, so we're gonna it can be second position or squat. Kind of plied. You're gonna bring your arms up, bend the elbows, put them behind, put your hands behind your head. So now I'm gonna travel to one side and travel to this side, one side, this side. 
right, left, whatever it is for you. Just gonna do a few of those, keeping it moving, okay? You guys ready? Okay. <laughs> Six, seven, eight. Now, your feet almost touch. Sometimes they will touch, but that's not really your goal, but you do want to pull them in. Now, you have to keep the back flat, and the core is engaged. Breathe. Two more. Make it two more. Make it two more. And the last one. You okay? Yep. All right. We're going to go into the dolphin pose, which goes into the dolphin plank pose, which goes into the upside down sit ups. You ready for all that? Yeah. Okay. So we're going to go down to the floor. Okay, we want to make sure that our wrists and elbows are in line with our shoulders. And we want to make sure our knees are underneath our hips. Okay, so then we're going to bring the forearms down to the ground. And we're going to press the forearms into the ground and the palms together. Roll the feet under like that. And I don't want to put my butt in your face, so I'm going to move back <laughs> here a little bit. Okay, and from there, you're going to push up into that position. Okay, you're going to keep the knees bent and your head is going to hang in between your arms. From there, you're going to press your heels down, keeping your back flat, shoulders away from your ears, making sure that you're breathing, forearms are pushing into the ground, into the floor, and the palms are pressing together. From there, we're going to bend. And now we're going to walk the feet back into the plank. So from here, you're going to walk the feet back. Make sure your back is flat. And then you're going to do sit-ups. Do not bring the upper body high. Keep the back flat. And keep the focus down. Are we ready? Yep. Here we go. To the right, to the left. Continue, and I will let you know when to stop. It's torture. You guys, it's okay, because this is not an easy movement. And so, <laughs> at all, at all. And so, but just don't bring your butt so high. It's more like, you just, yes, isn't that harder? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, see, she was trying to cheat, and I got her. I got her. What's going on over here, girl? Yes, okay, that's good. Pull that in. Okay, make sure you're breathing. I'm gonna mosey on over here. Let's do four more. One, two, three, four. I like that. All right, you guys. Yeah. Okay, all right. So now we're going to go into the trio push ups. Yeah. Okay, so for beginners, you guys, and do you mind demonstrating for the beginners? Okay. Not at all. Okay. All right. So we're going to go into the push-up position. You're going to make sure that your wrist and elbows are under your shoulders. And for the beginners, you can keep your knees bent. And if you have a carpet at home, you might want to do it on that. But it's not hurting your knees, right? So you're fine. So you can cross it or uncross it. And the first thing that we're going to do is the elbows are gonna go back. The elbows are gonna go back. Elbows are going back. So we're gonna do that one, then we're gonna bring the arms out, and then we're gonna bring the arms in into a triangle. Okay? And Ashley, you gonna do the regular push-ups for me? Yep. Okay, all right, so you guys ready to get started? Yeah. Are you ready to get started? Yeah. Now we're gonna do eight of each. So that way you know exactly how many we're doing and you can count it down yourself. Okay? Eight of each. Let's do it, ladies. Okay, so we're in the push-up position. Make sure your butt's not up, but you also want to make sure it's not down. Okay, here we go. The elbows are going back. Oh, okay, five, six, <laughs> seven, eight. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're going to open up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Pull it in. Triangle hands. Ready? One, two. Let me check on the girls. Three. It's okay if you don't go all the way down. That's not a problem whatsoever. I love it, but make sure you're breathing. And I need the neck to keep, yes. And don't go so far down. Yes, okay. Two more. Okay. Did I miscount? It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> you know what I meant, you know what I meant. Okay, so now we're gonna do the last thing. Kind of like a cool down, melt down, yeah? I'm gonna stand up. Gonna open the legs. Gonna bring the arms out in a second. We're gonna breathe in. And as we exhale, we're gonna go over. Keeping the focus up. And as you hit flat back, parallel to the ground, you're gonna drop your head and your arms. Now, Ashley, I want you to grab your ankles. Now these are the three different ways you can do it. I want you to grab your ankles and keep your head relaxed. I want you to pull in very gently. Minu, mm -hmm. I want you to keep your hands on the ground. Most beginners will choose this one. And then, Angelica, I want you to grab your arms and I want you to hang. And I want you guys to kind of twist. Just kind of swinging actually. Letting it go. Ashley, let it happen naturally. I'm gonna roll up. Let the swing happen naturally. Okay, so grab your arms and let the weight, but keep your, your shoulders away from your ears. Mm -hmm. Let the head relax, but still keep your shoulders away from your ears and kind of let it swing naturally. Do you feel that, you guys? Yeah. Okay, bring your arms up as well now, if you can, and just swing. Okay, do you feel that? Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna let go, it's kind of, I'll cool down, and you're gonna put your hands on the ground, and we're gonna roll up slowly. Bend your knees and roll up slowly, one vertebra at a time. Continue breathing. Take one last deep breath and release it. And that's your warm up. Now that wasn't too bad, was it? Okay, so you might want to take a look at my beginner's choreography or my advanced choreography, wherever you are technically, because you are ready. Your body is warmed, you're not gonna get injured, and you can five, six, seven, eight it. All right, see you soon.